Hey, it's Scott Arnold Cruise Consulting, and today we're talking about what is a guarantor, and it's kind of what it sounds like. A guarantor is someone who personally guarantees typically a loan obligation um, for a company with their own assets. So for example, if I put a letter of credit in place um, and the lender's like, hey, I don't know, I'm not sure this business is gonna make it or not, would you personally guarantee this loan? Um, pretty much all small businesses have to personally guarantee their loans. Um, then you become a guarantor. Um, so this is very, very common in bootstrap businesses. In the venture capital world, we actually encourage startups not to personally guarantee, encourage founders not to personally guarantee their loans. There's so much that could go wrong. And typically, VC back companies are always raising money. There's deeper pockets around the table than you, founder. Now, the one caveat to this is like maybe there's a founder who's had a really successful exit and it's worth 50 to hundreds of millions of dollars. That's something they might personally guarantee. You know, they're going to want to cap it, which another word for saying that is like a limited guarantee, basically cap it at the amount um, or a negotiated amount. Uh, but you will see that sometimes. Also, very, very rarely, a couple of times in my career, I've actually seen a VC firm guarantee a loan. Um, for a startup on a startup's behalf. And usually this will happen when maybe a VC fund is pretty short on money. The company is doing pretty well, but in kind of like getting over the hump, like just becoming profitable, it doesn't really need more capital from the VC fund, but a little bit of debt could be helpful. And when the VC fund is short on capital, they don't actually want to put out equity if they don't, if they can, can avoid it because they only have a couple bullets left. And so what they'll do is they'll personally guarantee the loan to the bank and say like, I'll put the equity into the company if I absolutely have to, if you tell me or call me, uh, but I'd rather save that bullet for another time if possible. Again, this is pretty rare. Like I've only seen this maybe two or three times in 20 years, uh, but I've definitely seen it happen. And it's always those very long in the tooth companies and a very long in the tooth uh, old VC fund that's just, doesn't have a ton of liquidity, but doesn't want this company to have to take more equity and get washed out. So that's where you typically see it. So just remember, if you're a VC backed company, if you're a founder, I would avoid personally guaranteeing a loan. If you're a small business, you're pretty much always gonna have to personally guarantee a loan and very, very occasionally a VC fund will actually guarantee one. Hope that helps. Hit us up at cruiseconsulting.com. If you have any other questions, please subscribe to our YouTube channel. We get uh, they'll help us reach more people and we put a lot of work in this. So we'd really appreciate it. Thanks. Bye.